Hey there everyone, this is Hell Cowling Yum 2, and last time a big thing happened. We got to the end of a path. It's kind of funny because I started the game at the first crossroad and kept taking. kept going to the left until it split again, then gradually worked our way to the right. Now we played the, basically a few paths, logical conclusion, and so we're gonna be working our way from right to left, making our way to the Bowser Cube until every path leads to there. Which brings us to the Block Art Survey! Oh man, by, by Doug himself. Ooh, this is quite an honor. I don't know what to expect. One exit, a house on the hill, the bush is all messed up. And we gonna eat some... Is this a puzzle? Well, there's a few doors. And, well, let's do it. Five question survey. So, I need to get the clues. Okay, on the first picture. Oh, wow. Zero, zero, one infinity. There's a fish. Okay. The fish doesn't mean anything. Alright, so we're gonna go and look at some art, and we need to keep information in mind. Okay. See, I feel... I, I didn't want to push in the questions, because I want to do it at least a little bit, for real. <laughs> Man. Alright, a big squiggly face with a mouth full of berries. Alright, man, yeah. I wish I hadn't used the broken picture quote for a tile yet. Alright, well, googly eye face with mouthful of berries. You're probably gonna ask how many berries I didn't even bother. Alright, here's the moon, a moon man looking, looking at a door. Oh boy. And here we got... Does that show anything, even? There's like half clocks. It's just, it's just blocks. Alright, well... Here's the five question survey. For what numbers are represented? I mean, I think it was... It was one... I'm thinking zero, zero, because there were two spheres. Right? Right? I like, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not silly here, right? See, like, it's... Uh... Okay, wait a second. You could consider that loop thing being infinity. And then that bar on the end one? Let me look at the things again. Looks like we're gonna have to do really creative interpretation. Yeah, one, the big great green bar, and then infinity, the eyes. No? Really? It's seven and eight? Really? Really? I don't believe you, but okay. What does one block share between picture one and three? Uh, it does not have a cyan. I'm gonna go dark green. I'm not sure though. Okay. Which two going arena are represented in picture two? I mean, it can be that. Oh wait, it could be. This is the... This is the Mario 3 cartoon names. Um, I think that's Roy and Morton. Which I think would be the answer, maybe? Yeah! <laughs> what would be showing if picture 3 is higher? Man, it doesn't look like anything. I'm gonna go with that. I'm just, just, I'm just going for it. Like, what do you mean if it was higher? Oh, this is Donkey Kong! I think? No. Well, I could see the glasses, though, argument. Alright, let's see if I... I wanna see 7 and 8, really? 7 and 8 in this. If you count in the inner corner, I guess? I don't know, man. I'm not seeing it at all. Sometimes, look, I've been trained as an artist. 
sometimes artists will say anything to that their work represent. You cannot trust. Yeah, dark green is what they share. And then it's the trick question where you think they're, they're saying gibberish. So it's kind of unfair because you need like outside knowledge, I feel like. It's not glasses. It's upside down roof. Like, I don't know what's an upside down roof, but that's the answer. Oh, wow. What? Which picture would be safe to land on spawn in midair? Picture two, right? Because, like, picture two is inside an actual room. Yeah! Oh, no! It's a pop quiz! Uh, using L and R, how many arrow tiles are there? I mean, I'm not seeing any, if that's what you're asking. Using L and R scroll? Man, I have no idea. I did not look. Oh, oh. Fish zone! Fish zone! Fish zone! There's like infinite answers, apparently. I'm gonna go in four? But I don't know. That's kind of ridiculous. Can you L and R scroll here? One, two, three! I hate you. I hate you so much. One, two, three. Was there three? Alright, it's seven, eight. At least the thing is, you can just remember them. Like, it's not that many entries. Dark green. Uh, bullion big mouth. Uh, it's upside down roof, whatever that means. This is a literal room. Supply sixth. 10. I went in 3, 4, 13. Oh, I didn't look well enough. Uh, could have been more though. This was all the fish family. Alright, okay. Cause see, I went there, I saw a three, but technically it might be three half. Can you scroll these? That's funny. I did eight. So, here we got eight. Alright, I keep pressing start, even though it's up, you need to press. So, we so we got eleven for now. Eleven... Thirteen... 15 And here, I don't know what this represents still So, 16! There's one right up there, right up there, hidden by, by the score counter Alright, so like, maximum amount represented Ah, oh, shoot, I gotta redo this first 16 was my conclusion. This is mostly rot. It's fine. I think it's an upside down house. Yeah, Tom, surprise. Okay, there's, there's no more here. So 16, so the, this one. Really? So the big outstretch there. <laughs> I did it! I fought the fish boss! I won! So the 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 fact that it stretches out that makes you think that's a clue, that in itself is an anti-clue. It is a counter clue. It's a clue that's there to make you confused. I like this level. Very unexpected. It's really silly. But it also so, like, there's very little tension. So, like, it doesn't matter if it's really, like, if there's a lot of trick questions and whatnot. If you're not expecting trick questions, <laughs> what are you doing? Heck of a this! Here we go! Uh, whoa, the way the music just kind of slid together there. Alright, what's gonna happen? We are in a pyramid. Turn hasn't figured out how to flip into 3D yet. The alignment of Saturn is where you'll only be able to walk on the center of any 3D platform. <laughs> Alright, well, thank you for- Ooh. Uh, what are you doing there? Yeah, I'm good at video games. Uh, I thought- how did I miss that mushroom? I'm not sure. Well, this is weird. Rolling this? Like, it's like they're- 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 they're roto-wheels. I don't know. 
Yeah, just jump right into it. That's the plan. Alright, nothing weird here. So this just might be a weird but otherwise normal level. Just jump right in that baseball. That's what we do today. Filter into unfilter. Well, into power-ups. Well, so make sure you don't get any fancy power-ups. I, I, I get it. Rude, but I get it. Whoosh, there we go. Look at that. It's a, it's a, it's a Mario level. You know? Using normal Mario rules. Like the fact that, yeah, Mario doesn't 3D. It doesn't even matter. Because I've, I've done this in just <laughs> hacks before. This is a hard combo there. Like, just a pro craziness bro guy and the, and the hammer bro. Yeah, Charlie, he's a real bro. Platform inside a row, there's a singular mushroom there. Waiting to be picked and eaten and thoroughly enjoyed. Maybe with some sausages? Maybe inside a pizza? I don't know, ma'am. I'm not picky. Uh, yeah, that's, that's what we're doing. Whoa, double toss combo. Okay, so I heeded the warning, more or less. You're not, you're not, you're not, you're not. Whoa, this is confusing. Your head just kind of popping there. Okay, what are you warning me about? Is it just that roto desk on the floor? Oh, flip, I made it. This is silly. <laughs> Alright. Nothing is safe, nothing is sacred, so just skip ahead. Okay, that's gonna make him drop. That's gonna make him something. That's gonna make him eat a cake full of lard. Lard cake. When you have too much sugar inside your camel. And you're like, wow. It's gonna have problems doing this marathon. Uh, okay. Scary jump there, you know, rotating spheres in the abyss. I think it auto- Whoa, did you see the way the, the background just kind of floppily doodled? The, where it took so dang long, and that previous room, that Saturn's now out of alignment. Dang it, what are we gonna do now? Nice going, buddy. Now all the 3D platforms and enemies are starting to phase into one another. Plane of existence! The normal color platform, now all the enemies live on the yellow plane. <laughs> this is really silly. Okay, all right, see, like, here, demonstrated, uh, oh, that's a flim, that's just a flim, yes, it looks like a decapitated Charlie, that's what flims are, whoops, too high, oh yeah, look at that, dang it, I'm so bad sometimes, there we go, just go fast, don't think, this is a really cool area, though, so, okay, right, Right, they don't land where I land. It's still a really cool area. Like, upside down, wow. desert, into the baseball. Really cool. Alright, this is rad though. It's a bit weird! But like, it's not that weird. Just jumping the hammer, bro, is just so weird. Same thing that happened last time. I don't know why. I don't know how that insists on happening. Right, I forgot why it was, so I was just... Let's just wait for a little bit. I can't believe I landed on that baseball. Warning, warning. Thank you for the warning. Warning, warning. Ugh. Oh boy, that's a sickly floor you got there. You gotta go to vet, man. These, I, my strategy has been just go, and here it failed spectacularly. Hurry in the land of the dead, everything is free. You've got a lot of depth, that's fine. Jumping. Oh boy, yeah, I, I, oh, okay, so. Very confusing, oh, okay. Shabadabadoo. Shibidibida. Then I'm gonna bounce somewhere. Then I'm gonna get a warning fair. Let's go to the warning fair. We can ride the warning wheel. Oh boy. Ride the 
bumper warnings. Oh, that is a lot of fun. Oh, right, I can't bop on you afterward. That's just confusing. Okay, I, th I saw that slowly moving gray thing. I was like, what is this? What is going on? Turns out it's just, it's just that. Spinning wheel. Spinning field. Oh, I thought I missed up. I didn't. Not yet. Hi. Hey. Okay. Uh, Alright. Stay for now. I'm just gonna do a jump here and die. Do you mind? Ah, oh, shoot! I knew, I knew that waiting was a mistake. But I still waited a few sec- like, a few fractions of a second, really. Dang it, well that's less fine. Ah, what? I didn't reach the floor? Really? I'm... wait, that, no. Okay. Like, what are you showing me here? Okay, I'm gonna be safe here. Oh boy. Alright, new stuff. Oh. Right. So... They're changing what the middle means. Because that thing is extra thick. Okay, I feel for that trap. Like, there's just, there's no... ifs or about about it. There was a trap that you could logically deduce. I didn't do it. Yeah, see? Here, it's it's four wide, and I'm number two. It's been in front of you since the start of the level. It just didn't click. I got confused by the swim not doing anything. Dang it! I forgot where I were in the level. So that extra thick boy there, yeah, like, we need to find the center of it. That's probably where the coins are. Yeah. Oh, there's the end. Dang it! Ah! How did I let myself die like that? I was greedy. I was super greedy. I just jumped. Oh. Really? Right in the middle. Nah, man. No, why didn't... <laughs> no, I... Get in. This is a really cool level. 
it's not Yump at all, other than the name and text. Like, this was a solid, kinda weird platforming level, but it's not, lot, not weird enough to be, like, super weird. This is kinda weird. Uh, that's gonna lead to that castle, and this is gonna lead to that castle. I don't know if it's gonna lead to that and there and there and there. Well, I mean, well, I guess we'll find out eventually. Don't overcomplicate things for no reason, dude.